these go verbs, these verbs that take go instead of o for the I version in the present, also behave a little bit strangely in the future tenses, in the will and would tenses. So we can look at that now and whilst looking at it, revise the endings that we learned for will and would. So we said that our will endings, what we add on to the to form of the verb to get will, are the same as those very irregular versions of aber in the present. So we can make that connection to help us internalize them. Can you talk me through those will endings? So it's e for I and emos for us. For we, very for good. We. A for he, she, it and you formal. An for they. They are you plural. And the last one, you informal. Us. Good. So we have the endings. And our endings for would, which again we are adding on to the to form of the verb, we need to remember one key sound for would. If we remember how to say I would like, that's a nice hook to remember the key sound. So what is the key sound? Ia. Ia. And then on to ia, we can add on, of course, our mos or en or s if we need to. Good. So, go verbs, these verbs that have go and then ga for the mood tense, when they are building the futures, they have a contraction. But they all make the same contraction. For example, I will have is tendre. 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 So, of course, it should be tenere, no? But it's tendre. So, that last e of tener turns into a d, and we get tendre. This is a contraction, because it means we end up with two syllables instead of three. It would be tenere, but it's tendre, which just makes everything a little bit more efficient. But all of these verbs, these go verbs, are behaving in a similar way. So, we have to come. Venir. Venir. And I will come. Vendré. Vendré. Very good. I would come. The same contraction for both futures. Vendría. Vendría. Good. I would come. We would come. Vendríamos. Vendríamos. We would come later, but we don't have time. We would come later, but we don't have time. Vendríamos más tarde. Pero no tenemos tiempo. Good. Vendríamos más tarde, pero no tenemos tiempo. What was to put? Poner. And I put? Pongo. Pongo. So, this go alerts us to the fact that this verb will behave in this irregular way as well. So, if we want to say, I will put it here, how will it be? I will put it here. Lo pondré aquí. Good. Lo pondré aquí. I would put it here. I would put it here. Lo pondría aquí. Good. We would put it here. Lo pondríamos aquí. Good. Lo pondríamos aquí. And we will put it here. Lo pondremos aquí. Good. Lo pondremos aquí. What was to leave or to go out? Salir. Salir. I leave or I go out? Salgo. Salgo. So again, this go can set off a little alarm bell that this verb will probably be irregular in the futures. So how would you say I would leave or I would go out? Saldría. Saldría. Good. You would leave or you would go out informally? Saldrías. Saldrías. Will you leave? Will you go out tonight? Will you go out tonight? Saldrías esta noche? That's would you. Now we want will you. Saldrás esta noche? Good. Saldrás esta noche? But of course we have esta noche, which is future context, so we could just use the present. We could just say you go out tonight. We don't need the future, so how would that be? Sales esta noche. Sales esta noche. Good. 
So for most go verbs, we take off the go and we put dre for I will and dria for I would. With most of them, traer to bring doesn't do it. Traere, I will bring. Atraere, I will attract. Distraere, I will distract. But most of these that have go will go to dria or dre. Aser and desir, to do or to make or to say or to tell, aser and desir, are particularly irregular. And we've already seen this. We've seen how after aber they become echo and dicho. It's very irregular. We saw how the informal command from aser is as, H-A-Z, again irregular. And here as well, I will do is are. So it's not following this rule, it's even more irregular. We have are, are, I will do, I will make. Are. H-A-R-E, are. And all we need to do is identify one of these irregularities and then we understand that all of will and all of would we use the same base, the same base that are has used. Uh, so we will do or we will make is? Haremos. Good. And we would do or we would make? Haríamos. Haríamos. We would do it, but we're busy now. We would do it, but we're busy now. Lo haríamos, pero estamos occupied. Ocupados ahora. Good. Lo haríamos, pero estamos ocupados ahora. We would do it, but we're busy now. So haríamos is we would do or we would make. And what is we will do or we will make? Haremos. Haremos. And they will do, they will make? Harán. Harán. I would say, or I would tell, is diría. So we get from decir, diría. I would say, he would say, she would say, you formal would say. Diría. So, like I said, we just need one of these versions to understand how the rest will be. So if diría is I would say or I would tell, how is I will say or I will tell? Diré. Diré. I will tell you later, speaking informally. Te diré más tarde. Good. Te diré más tarde. And of course, having future context with más tarde, we could just say... Te digo más tarde. Good. Te digo más tarde. I tell you later. What was to be able to? Poder. Poder. How do you say I would be able to or I could? Podría. Podría. Good. The F falls out. So this is a different irregularity. This is not a go verb. Podría. Of course it was podería, but many years of podería, 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 podería. The E fell away. Podría. How is to put? Poner. Poner. And I would put? Pondría. Pondría. Good. So there's a subtle difference in sound between... I would be able to, podría, and I would put, pondría. We would be able to? Pondríamos. We would be able to, that's we would put. Podríamos. Podríamos. And we would put? Pondríamos. Pondríamos. 